Hello, beautiful. I am a ginger. I might keep this for like longer than a week, but we'll see. Because this was an impulsive decision one night at like 1 a.m. And um, I just did it, you know? Today, we're doing one of my favorite, favorite things, which is watch people follow my haircut tutorials. And this has been a quick turnaround, I'll tell you. I think it was like a couple weeks ago, I made a how to do a butterfly cut video. And now we got some people trying it out and hopefully it looks good. And hopefully I don't screw anybody over because that's my worst fear. So please tell me they followed my directions. But before we start today's video, I want to thank my amazing, lovely sponsor, BetterHelp. You guys know I love it. And that is because this brain it's a lot sometimes to live in here. So talking to a professional really helps me sort through all of the craziness going on in my, my head. Um. <laughs> If you think you might be feeling depressed, stressed, anxious, or overwhelmed, well, our sponsor today, BetterHelp, is there for you. BetterHelp offers licensed therapists that are there to listen to you and help you. You can talk to your therapist private, online, and in any environment you want. There is a huge, broad range of expertise in BetterHelp's 20,000 plus therapist network. That gives you access to help that may not be available in your area. All you gotta do is fill out the questionnaire to help assess your specific needs. Then all you gotta do is secure your video and phone sessions with your therapist. Plus, my favorite part, you can exchange unlimited messages. And everything you share is completely confidential. You can also request a new therapist at any time at no end extra cost. Join the 2 million plus people who have taken charge of their mental health with an experienced BetterHelp therapist. Get 10% off your first month at betterhelp.com backslash bradmondo. That's better H-E-L-P backslash bradmondo. Also linked below in the description box. All right, let's watch people follow my butterfly haircut tutorial. This video is by Pauline Gonzalez. Hey guys, so we're gonna be doing Bradmondo's butterfly cut on my hair. It's the butterfly cut. Ooh, it's kind of pretty. This is my natural hair. Um, just long, no layers or anything in it. Holy sh! She has the best canvas to do this cut. She has the longest, healthiest, gorgeousest hair ever. And the highlights are gonna really show the layering and I'm just excited. This haircut's pretty foolproof, I think. But I've thought that many times before and y'all still find a way of f***ing it up. So Brad says to always wet the hair first. Can we actually replay that part of my video where I said, you better wet your f***ing hair. Yes, that means you watching, trying to do this haircut. You also need to wet your hair. You are not exempt from that rule. Yeah. Listen, she's listening. Okay, now we have to find the apex. Oh, oh, she's breaking up the hairstylist terminology too. The apex, we all know what the apex is, right? The highest point of the head. You have to like lay it down like this. Okay. And wherever like, I don't know, like the tallest point of my head. Like, like I guess maybe feel this straight. Yes, you were doing it right. It, you lay the comb down and wherever it meets the, the, the head is where the apex is. Oh, that section looks fresh as fuck. You two look a little crazy though. You look a little crazy. Okay, and then we do the back part. Oh, as high as you can possibly be. That's right. Oh my God. That's a unicorn. I just want to know why this isn't called a unicorn cut. I'm confused. What is the, these names? They come from like wolf cut, butterfly cut. I don't know if I vibe with the creative direction on those names. I'm thinking more like unicorn cut. I'm thinking more like. I don't know. Okay, so that is the I'm so glad people followed my meditation advice too. This is great. <gasps> this is how much we cut off. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. She needed that. And look at those ends. They're fucking shitty and dry. And they're gonna drop to the floor and we're gonna see a blossom. A blossoming of layers. Okay, not bad. Not okay. bad, right? Yeah, way better. Okay. okay. All right, let's see the final product or the final product. <laughs> what came out here? This, this is a homage beat. Did not cut. <laughs> or maybe. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, it's so short. Put it together. Oh sh. It is kind of short. It is kind of short. Start off long, guys. You can always cut more, but at the same time, cut enough because it won't show unless you cut like a significant amount. That is very bad direction, but 
Yeah. Oh my god, what did I do? What did yeah. I do? What did I do? <gasps> I told you you're gonna have layers in the front. Girl, what did you do? She's just not done, right? She's gonna connect. It's gonna be fine. Okay, so we're just gonna fix up some little spots here and there, even some things out, and then I'm gonna blow dry it and I'll be right back. Ugh, I can't wait to see the end result, but fuck. It's looking t just a little bit rough right now. She gonna pull together with the blow and everything. I hope so. Okay, so I took a shower, I washed my hair, and I blow dried it so we could see the full results. Wow, I really love it. Definitely gave me a lot of volume, and you can see all the layers that came out. This is not curled. I just put it in like a little bun after I blow dry it. I love it. Here's the back, so you guys can see. Yeah. Oh, it looks so incredible. I love it. It's exactly what she needed. She needed that layering. She needed that cut. She needed that boom, that pizzazz, that bang, bang, boom. Like just like a little thump, uh, mm. Mm. You go, girl. Slay. Okay, one slay down. How many more slays are we gonna get today, baby? Up next, we're gonna buy Goja. Brad Mondo, this is what you made me do. This is a shit ton of hair. Very interesting style, too. If I cut it right underneath my my face, then it's still a lot. It is. It, listen, it is a lot. And when you come from having no layers to doing this, it's gonna be a huge difference. But a good difference. My birthday's coming up soon. Hopefully, if it goes wrong, someone will pay for the hairstylist. Oh! Her birthday's coming up. If this goes wrong, I'm sorry. If it goes right, this is my birthday gift to you. How do you do a heart like this? There's so many ways to do a heart, you know? Wait, hold on. This way? No. I Whatever. I did the back. Very high ponytail. Not so sure if it's as nice as this part here, but it's right here. You guys are doing great with the sectioning, and you guys are really pulling the hair forward, and boom, bang, it's looking great all around. I think with her, I would have just pulled the ponytails a little bit tighter and a little bit higher in the back. I think I'm gonna cut it now. My favorite part about this is that the ponytail is going around her glasses. <laughs> don't do that. And it's still wet. It's still wet. So I don't have any problems with that. Just kidding, it's behind the glasses. My bad. That's how you did it, right? <laughs> Damn, so much hair at once. Maybe I should do a bit less and then go for more afterwards. That's what he said. Yeah, that is what I said. <laughs> thank you, Brad, from the past. Um, Future Brad is... Thank you. Because I... That seems like a bit much hair for her. I don't know. I don't know about that. Okay, she's really going for it. I was like, I got six inches. Ha 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 Come on, hurry up. I want to see what it looks like. <laughs> okay. Now put this to the front. I checked this video again and now I'm doing this here. Should be enough. I think I'm probably going to do the same as before, so around here. The little bit of over direction she's doing is looking fabulous. She's following the directions. Her hair is wet. Yes! Uh Okay, make sure you brush your ponytail out before you start cutting. I see it not being brushed. Brush it, and then, whoosh, you know, because it's gonna look crazy. This is worrisome. She made the last cut. Let's see what we're working with. Let's take this part off first. I've been walking around with like um, this parting for two days. Oh, Jesus. It's not very cute. Oh my god. Oy, oy, oy. Oh. I don't even know what to say. This is why you do these home haircuts with caution. <laughs> they are not foolproof, and it is not the same as a professional hairstylist doing it for you. But if you're in a pinch and you don't want to break the bank, you know, it's a great option. In this case, I don't know how she's gonna fix this. It's looking chunky and funky. Well, it's too late now. Mm. 
Wait, is it all of a sudden coming together or is it just me? <laughs> no, 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 no. Um, it's okay. It's gonna be okay, right? <laughs> Uh, uh, uh. Girl, it's looking all funky. Oh my god, this is so bad! <laughs> How does it look like from the back though? Yeah, show us the back. Give me that at least. <laughs> is it bad? The back is slant. The front needs a little bit of a... A blending. A blending, What's, I would say a blend. I did put that in my video, so you better listen. Let's she it out a little bit like he said to do. She's blending. Yes! Oh my god, that's like such bad layering. Like this side is perfectly good, to be honest. But the, like this here? I don't know what the fuck happened. Two days later. This side kind of curves and this here doesn't really. So it almost seems like it's uneven, but it's not. Otherwise, uh, I don't know, my hair just seems a little bit dry even though it's not, but I'm not mad. I love it! It was really spooky at one point, but it came it came through. Butterfly cut, baby. Come on, girl. Slaying people all around the world. Also, I think you should go copper. She said she wants to go copper. I think that would look fabulous on you. And I am a little bit biased because my hair is copper, but you know, it look good. This next video is by Fadish26. I just, you know, I cut off the front bit first and then I cut off the back bit. I measured it. We're one second in, but I gotta say, I love the color on her and she has such thick, beautiful, luscious, gorgeous hair that I can't wait to see layers in. And I love that she's Australian. That's all I need, love. It's all I need. That's not Australian, but it's British. I watched a video the other day, a Brad Mondo video, and I absolutely adore Brad Mondo. I adore you. He did a tutorial for a butterfly cut. I normally do a triple unicorn cut with a beard cut, which is where you get it and you just bring it down there and you cut across the bottom because it gives a nice rounded shape at the back. A triple unicorn cut? Hold on, there's a unicorn cut now? <laughs> Where? Hold on. <laughs> that sounds like a fucking gymnastics move. Round up, back handspring, back tuck, triple unicorn cut. So good, she has a little bit of experience with cutting her own hair. We're off to a good start. I am going to use what I always use. Proper scissors. Look at that. Yeah. Is that three for three? People using the proper cutting scissors? I need to stop teaching people how to do their hair so well because I'm gonna be out of a fucking job. Why did I do this? I'm going to find the apex and just lay the cream on top going forward from. And then from there down to my ears and forward from there down to my other ear. Now I want this really smooth. I'm gonna do a ponytail right at the front. This is the fourth time I'm trying to do this. Why is this the fourth time? Sometimes I don't realize things are so hard for people because obviously I am I am a professional. I don't know, the things that you guys find hard, it's so silly to me sometimes. Perfect, I am happy with that. That's in the middle enough for me and it's low enough for me. And I'm gonna cut off about that much. I'm, not, I'm, I'm measuring it down here, I'm not gonna cut it there. I'm gonna cut it there because Brad said to do it, you know, like on the same line that you put the ponytail in. Exactly. So if the ponytail is here, you gotta pull it out here. Not here, not here, okay? That way you get the right amount of layering and the right shape. Okay, your elevation and the angle that you pull the hair out from the scalp changes a haircut completely. <laughs> Look at all that. <laughs> okay, she did step one. I mean, you can't really see the outcome of it yet, but it's looking good. And now she's on step two. Where she's gonna put that shit up in the back, baby. And she's gonna do another cut. Do the back as well. All right, so, clean that out. That's too far forward, mate. To cut this bit, right, said you cut the same amount off and you like over direct it forward. I've got this. You got this. You have got this. <laughs> Not straight up, a little bit forward. Yeah, she's on there. She's a queen. So that would be around about a little bit here, a little bit forward. That's quite a lot, isn't it? Oh, you're cutting that much? Okay, okay. I don't know why this makes me anxious every time. Like, it's gonna be fine. <laughs> That's how much I cut off. That was definitely a lot, whoa. Let's see what we've got. Now apparently there will be a bit of a disconnect between the back and the front, which I can just trim up. Really look like I've taken much off. Oh, yeah, I guess there's, there's, yeah, there's more layers through there. Mm, it's looking good so far. I hope, I hope we get a blowout moment. Like, I hope 
I wanna see it. Mm. Now she's refining the cut, which is so important, guys. Like, you gotta do those finishing touches when you're doing these just like two cut things. Like, it's it's not enough. You gotta make sure the back connects with the front. The face trimming is thinned out a little bit. Her hair's so thick. She needs to finesse it a lot. I'm just going to comb it all forward. And this is just, to, this is how I get rid of any sort of disconnect that's there. Bring it forward. Tiny a little bit there. So that's all even. And the same on this side. And I start at the front because I can't remember why. I think I saw both ones I do it one day. A little bit there. You can just say, so how it just goes a bit uneven. Oh, she is pulling out some hairstylist moves here. She's doing a full on comb with a little thing and angling her fingers at a perfect angle and getting rid of those pieces that stick out. Great idea. I just, you know, I cut off the front bit first and then I cut off the back bit and I, I measured it. That's what I cut off the front. <laughs> Are you ready for this? That's what I cut off the back. <laughs> the difference. Oh yeah, we well, <laughs> might have cut a little bit more off the back and off the front. That's maybe not gonna look great. It's gonna be a little uneven. Just had a shower. I washed my hair and I conditioned it, and I have not touched it with a towel. You can you can probably see that it's just it is it's dripping. Let's see it dry. Hi guys. I have avoided touching my hair as much as possible. Somehow the haircut has still worked. And give it a good scratch like that. You can probably see. <laughs> oh my god. <gasps> Brad. If I didn't already love you, I'd do now. I'm in love with myself right now. <laughs> Mm, that looks good as hell. With her natural texture, it looks so even and precise too. I don't even know. Ooh, ah, this is good. It's gone, well, not, not curly. It needs to be quite a lot shorter to actually be curly, but it's gone wavy and it feels amazing. Look at those layers. I could maybe do with some more face framing, but I'd, I'll wear it for a week and see, see what I think. I'm, but I might want some more layers in that. Oh my God, I'm so happy. It looks amazing. Ah, oh, great end result. I'm sitting here thinking this result is like mm, salon quality good. Unless you go to like an absolute f pro cutter. Like this is pretty good. I will say I would not know the difference between this cut and a just normal everyday hairstylist. Like this is good. She looks great. You guys absolutely slayed that tutorial. Oh my God, everybody listened to me. All the advice I gave, like you guys actually did it and see what happens, it comes out good. You can trust me, I got your back. If you guys wanna check out my hair care, my hair color line, it is all linked below or you can go to xmodelhair.com. That is all for today. Thank you guys for watching and don't forget to live your extra life. I'll see you next time, bye.